I'm not sure if we can outspeed. We are? Come on. Hello everybody and welcome back to another competitive Pokemon Scarlet and Bailu video here on the channel. And in today's video we'll be using this team which will be a full water type team and it will be consisting of following Iron Bundle Dundos of Palapa, Tatsugiri Dreadnought and Palafin. So as you can see this is all the hardcore hitters of the water type which is eligible in uh, Regulation C. So, if you want to check this team out yourself, make sure to use the render code down in the description below on the top right hand corner here of this screen. So, without further ado, just let's get straight in. So, our first matchup. So, our first matchup here will be against a Pelipo and a Murkrow, two Tailwind setters in one team. Dragonite, actually, as well. That's three Tailwind setters. Goichomp, um, and then a. What did I forget your name for a minute there? But Iron Bundle and uh, come on, it's right in the tongue. It's not Chiyu, it's not Tingle, it's not, it's not Wuchin. It's right in the tongue. I forgot it for a minute. Why did I forget that for a second? Anyway, it's Ice Dark, that's all that matters. Okay, so I feel like we might. We go the Pelipper Dreadnought lead here. Bring Iron Bundle. Um, no, no, I have an idea here. Let's go for the Dreadnought Palafin uh, lead here with Iron Bundle and Pe yeah, Dreadnought Palafin lead with Dreadnought. No, with Pelipper and Iron Bundle in the back because in first turn, switch out Palafin. Into Pelipper, so Dreadnought will gain double speed. Um, I think that's what we'll try to do here because I assume he's gonna try and go for a, for a Tailwind, and I kind of don't want to see that happen. But well, I'll probably see it happen either way. It's not gonna be Chin Pao. There it was. That's what I meant. I actually think it's quite weird that they put they put Chin Pao and then Dragonite instead of you know what order they actually came in as. Okay. Oh, we have Rock Slide. Let's go for Rock Slide, shall we? Rock Slide and then it's a Pelipper here. Here's my only concern: is he both have E Speed and Saga Punch. So what he could potentially do here is go for e speed and sucker punch into my dreadnought which would probably KO us and then it would have been a very bad start to today's episode but if you just go into one into Pelipper we will be able to um so e speed comes out okay it actually doesn't do that much damage question is did you go for sucker punch he goes for the sucker punch it doesn't KO, luckily for us, it does not KO. And Rock Slide misses one of them, of course it does. And this is the Dragonite. We get the Chin Pao down to really good stuff here, though. Kind of. Are we seriously gonna lose him here? Unfortunately, I feel like we are gonna lose him. Let's just hit the Chin Pao here. And he does go for the Trashalization. Question is, what is it into? It is into E Speed, so he's probably gonna try and E Speed. Maybe the Pelipper. Would be interesting to see here. E speed comes out. Is it into the Dreadnought or the Pelipper? It isn't the Pelipper. It doesn't KO. Question is Sucker Punch? Definitely KOs. Okay, but we will get the Hurricane off and therefore we will be taking down um, that Chen Pao. But an E speed Dragonite is definitely a massive threat here. 
So I think we have to bring in Palafin here. The, my only cons... What would he bring in here? Is Murkrow? Why would you bring Murkrow in here? Confuses me a bit. Hmm. Anyway. Let's... Type. It's not like you're particularly great. So we could potentially have Pelipper left, Guy Chomp, or Iron Bundle. I assume with what he played out with, it's not gonna be Pelipper, is it? Probably gonna be Iron Bundle. So I'll go for Jet Punch. I'll go into Dragonite. Go for it. Go for Hurricane into Dragonite as well. Just to make sure if we don't KO the Dragonite with the Jet Punch, um, that we will with the, um, the, uh, what's it called? The, um, so each becomes, I'll just probably into Palafin. It is. Doesn't KO, doesn't even deal that much damage. So we come with Jet Punch here. It's gonna do a lot of damage. Okay, never mind, it is not. It goes for its hurry. It, uh, its own hurricane. And we get confused. Okay, I've never seen a Mercury hurricane. This is weird. Okay, Citra better come out here. Our own hurricane comes. Doesn't KO. So now we have a little bit of a problem. Because his Murkrow will be going before me. So will his E speed. If we protect. Potentially Hurricane his Dragonite. Could we be able to do a decent play here? Hiko, hate him. Because what is what is Murkrow go for a tailwind here? Oh I forgot we confused. Please hit it. <laughs> of course we doesn't hit it. East Beat comes out and they'll KO us. Oh It's a Pelipper. That's weird. Hurricane? I still can't believe we... Oh, that's probably gonna be game. Because I don't know what we... If... If Iron Bundle is gonna be able... To do anything. I just... I don't see how. I honestly don't see how. Like... Oh, I was like, why does it hit twice? I thought it was freeze dry, and then I realized it was icy wind. We're not going to be able to, So, E-Speed is probably going to KO, because we have no defense on Iron Bundle. It doesn't KO. But, oh, it comes out with Tailwind there. Nice. Nice. Freeze dry. That does KO, in fact. But he'll come out with an Iron Bundle here. Either way, that's going to be quicker than us, so it won't really matter too much. To be honest. And the rain stops as well. Uh, we probably should have went with. Yep, yeah, and it's Quark Drive. It has to boost the energy. So we're probably going to take the other in the first matchup. Um, or not probably, we will because there's no way we're going to win this, this battle here. So just. Yeah. Better just to go and get straight into our second one. So, we'll be going up against a Annihilate and a Chin Pao and Dragonite Flutterman, Tinglu and a Amoongus. So, very, very slow team actually. What will we be doing here?
Dreadnought's not going to do too much damage into... I mean, I guess with the Ice, ice Spinner. This is what we got, my friend. Eager Liquidation. Probably think you don't really have too much, do you? No, you just did Jet Punch and Crash. Not really any... Doso. Tazagiri and Dreadnought. Yep. Yeah. Let's go with this lead. I don't think this team will be. Um, it's not very Palafin or. Iron Bundle friendly, I would say. In general, this team is very bad for water type Pokemon, actually. Because <laughs> there's not really any fire type on it or anything like that. He comes out with the Dragonite. Annihilate Bleed here. Actually, try. Yeah, let's try this actually. Let's just see here. Okay, try slice straight away. It's probably into the the goddamn fire. Nope, water. No mind. We should have brought our good old iron bundle, but now we didn't. Now we have no super effective moves into the water type. Nice, and it goes to bulk up too. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Dragon probably goes to Dragon Dance. Thunder Punch. Oh. Mm, not particularly nice. And we get. Of course, we get paralyzed. Auto up. Ooh. Not really great damage. Let's bring the Tats in here. The good old Tatsugiri. Um, hopefully, he went for E speed into the Tatsugiri slot. Or something like that. Like, just. Or Thunder Punch into a good old Dozo. Because with the Tresselization that's steel, then we should be sound. That's just what I'm hoping for. But I, I, I have been very wrong in our reads here today, so we could be mistaken once again. Let's see here. What are you up to, my good old friend here? EQ won't affect Dragonite, obviously, with us. Not the plan, neither. I just want that goddamn an island taken down. Oh, it's not enough. Rage Fist. Thank you very much. Thunder Punch. Yep. Nice. Okay, perfect. Do we have any other flying types? We don't. I don't know why, I just feel like he's not gonna keep that an eye a bit. I just don't feel like it. Rage first. It's going to Dragonite. I have a feeling he's going to take out the... Oh, he takes out the Dragonite, in fact. I was not expecting that at all. Are you send out? Flutter. Nope. Okay, that's somewhat okay, I guess. Okay, question is... Ok, 
can we do here? Yeah, I guess EQ is our only real choice here. With plus three attack and terrestrialization on and <sighs> um yeah that's about it i was about to say rain but i forgot it's not even a water type move so it won't do that much damage either way he's probably gonna go for spoil rage fist excuse me please ko oh that's a crit that's a big ass crit, but we will be hit by the the spore probably. So yeah, spore comes out here. So if he brings out his dragon knight in his dragon dance, oh, we have lumberry on. So nice, good job. Dragon knight comes out. Yep, nice. Let's order up this, um, this little, yep, that's fine, that's completely fine. I'm going for you either way, so you just wasted that, kinda. Hold up. And then, Dragon Eye, what will you do? Dragon Dance? Potentially, Low Kick? Ooh, deals a lot of damage into us. Don't like that. Rain stops here. Doesn't affect us either way at the moment. What's your last mon here? It is the flood, I mean. Do I have a mon here that can. Mm, don't really know if I can deal with that flutter. Probably, yeah, I'd probably rather go for an EQ. No, I'd probably rather go for Wave Crash, actually. Shadow Ball, please don't KO. It probably will KO, let's be honest. Yep, it will. And it was a crit as well. But. Okay, let's see here. Let's see, let's see. Come on. Low kick, don't do too much damage. Thank you very much. I feel like going for Surf actually. I feel like just getting some good damage off here. You know, I'm not sure if you will be able to. If we will survive this, I highly doubt it. I honestly highly doubt it because I feel like, first of all, this flood is gonna outspeed us and it's probably gonna Dazzling Gleam or Moonblast us and we will die pretty much immediately. It doesn't outspeed. Incredible. I'll take this. I'll definitely take that. How much did you get? Mm, decent amount. And it's a crit. I'll take that crit, definitely. That's in Gleam. Probably gonna KO Tattoo. Yep. But I'll definitely take that. That was, that was worth protecting the Surf. Definitely worth it. Please do not Dragon Dance. Please don't. Okay, low kick. It's fine. Fine, 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 fine. Now my question is, what do we go for here? I'm gonna hurricane you either way. Rock slide or ice spinner. We could EQ. No. Liquidation? No. I feel like rock slide. I feel like rock slide. Rock slide. Honestly, I'm not sure if we're gonna outspeed. We are? Come on. And it's, a, and it's a KO. Come on, it's double KO. That's what we like to see here from Dreadnought. Clutching up here in the last moments. And we will take the D up here. And that is definitely so really played this well. So, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely take that. That was, that was really, really nice. The rain coming out here in clutch with Dreadnought attached to it here in the end. Okay, so we will be against my favorite lead here. 
Tailwind, um, Talonflame, Great Task, King Gambit, with a Ndidi and Toyko and a little cheeky um, Goldengo. Um, Iron Bundle could be a great lead if he goes for the Tailwind lead. Palafin could be sweet here. Could actually be very sweet here. Oh, not you. I want to go for Pelipper. And I want to go for... Drenor. Um, yes, let's go for that. But let's wait quick. Oh, not to that. To this. And, oh, I didn't even make the, the screenshot. I was trying to go here for, <laughs> for, for the thumbnail screenshot. And we didn't even make it. Because we went on... A full screen, full screen instead of um, the one without the webcam on. Let's see here. Okay. A little predictable. Well, not, I mean, Greatos was definitely going to be there. Question. I don't know why you bring out the King Gambit though. I feel like this might be a bit. Uh, kind of go for freeze dry, but I also feel like he's gonna trash the lies. Uh, whatever. Because I'm not really gonna deal damage into the goddamn King Gambit. Please. Do not trash the lies, my friend. Do not trash the lies. Cyber Punch. Oh, ouch. Oh, it's Life Orb. So it's Life Orb Gambit. Oh, let's go. Nice. Let's go. Who do you send out here? Show me. Hey, that's the good old Torko. I think he's gonna go for the sucker punch into bundle. Yep, yes. I think he's probably gonna go for the solid eruption. Doesn't do damage, but whatever, it's fine, I guess. Can you do this right now? Hopefully, you can. Please survive this eruption. I need you to survive this eruption. Come on, Red. No, you got this, my friend. You got this, my friend. I believe in you. Fire has to be like a four times. Uh... Oh, we definitely survived that. Easy. Yeah, it's a strongly resist. That's why I put you in. Good boy. We switch you out. It's a Pelipper. Go for hardcore EQ. And we fuck both of you up. Unless this is a um, flying <laughs> Torko, which has been running around between teams now and then. I've seen, I've seen a couple of them. I used one in the previous video myself as well. So, wouldn't honestly wouldn't surprise me if he comes out with a with a flying Torko here. EQ comes out without any. That's some good damage. Total cleave. Nope. Okay, that's okay. Earth power. This good damage. Okay, so now we know. He's not. Set the tailwind. Go for the stress light station. Go for another EQ here. Because he won't be going for another eruption. 
We'd probably go for Sucker Punch. And another Earth Power, but if we Dressalize into Grass, we'll be just fine here. What if we go for then for the direction we are? Kind of fucked. Not gonna lie, but let's hope that's not the route he's taking. I just want that King Gambit gone so we can't get sucker punched. Because I'm quite frankly afraid of that. A lot. Sucker punch? Yeah, like I said. Quite frankly afraid of that. We just wasted our terror on that. Nice. Good job. Heat wave. This has to be my try. He has to try sugar punch into my into my my bundle. You have to try that. It has to be into my bundle. Watch it not being into my bundle. Just watch it. He's been to my bundle. Talent plane? Please be into the bundle. Please be into the bundle. Please. Yes, come on. Please KO with this hurricane. Please KO this hurricane. Oh, we don't even KO. Nice. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. nope. Probably gonna suck up punches, isn't it? Probably is. Oh, he says the. Oh, I know what he's doing. Yeah. He's just gonna try and set this on. We should have went for the. The good, good old fashioned. Um, yep, suck up punch. I honestly wanted to switch our bundle so bad, but I thought he would read me again because we already did that once. But. It's. it's Okay, but if we miss this, that's... Oh, we don't miss this. Let's go. Ooh, that deals a lot of damage. And we get him confused. Beautiful stuff here. Beautiful stuff here. Beautiful stuff here. Okay, I feel like we can take this a bit slow. I feel like we can protect and protect just because I feel like he is gonna probably terrestrialize this round so we will know what to do with our terrestrialization or with our attacks because we know what terrestrialize or what terror type he has. So that's why I'm going for the double protect just so we can be a bit safe here. Okay, he don't actually. Okay, we got the uh, protect off of the Toyko, that's fine. Brave Bird. Into you, that's okay, I guess. Two and gone. I mean, there's not really much else I can go for, is there? Just highly, I just highly, highly doubt you have protect on it. Brave Bird, don't kill me. Okay, that's a lot of damage though. Get punch. Not even a KO. Oh, we hit a hurricane once again. Helipa putting in the way. God damn. What do you go for here, Torko, you cheeky bastard? It's not that this confusing. What do you go for? Earth power, don't KO, please. Nope. It's fine. And we would definitely take the, um, the dub here. As, uh, there's not really much you can do against us. Hurricane, Jet Punch, easy win here. 
Yep, battle was cancelled, so we take the dub here and um, phenomenal play. So that will be it for today, and as you can tell, this team is very, very strong, but it also has its weaknesses as it is very, very weak to uh, grass type moves in general and, and other stuff. But it, it's very fun to use, and it's also very, very strong. As you could tell so if you want to try this team out yourself and give it a go make sure to use the range code down in the description below on the top right corner here off this screen and if you if you enjoyed today's content make sure to smash the thumbs up button subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss a single video and otherwise happy battle folks